better hold my breath now. And I'll show you just how fine this stuff is. If you leave it there for a while, it settles, it turns into like sand. But after, once you mix it, the air stays in there and it almost flows like water. So, here we go. Oh. <laughs> wow. I saw it coming. Biochar is basically charcoal made from biomass. So we're not talking plastics, we're not talking coal, which is a mineral, but a fossil mineral. Uh, made from biomass, can be made from any biomass, from wood, from straw, from crop waste, from manures, from uh, fruit, you know, fruit pits, nutshells, any, any kind of biomass waste. There is already a lot of biochar in soil. A lot of the most fertile soils we have in the world, which are where there used to be or there is prairie vegetation, like uh, the Midwest and the US, uh, the steppes in, in Russia and, and parts of China, at least in the past, are soils where historically and naturally fires would come through uh, regularly. So these, when you look at these soils, they, already ha they have a lot of biochar charcoal through their profile and they're very fertile. Terra Preta is kind of the, the, the phenomenon or the soil type that really inspired modern biochar interest in, in, in biochar technology in recent years. Um, Terra Preta refer, refers to a specific kind of soil in the Amazon that, as you say, evolved after people put, yes, charcoal and also lots of other things in there, uh, over, you know, and evolved over hundreds to thousands of years in specific in specific climate and in a specific, you know, mineral soil. So, you know, I, I, always, I always get uneasy when I hear people, oh, we're, this is, ter we're making Terra Preta because you, you, you can't, you know, it, it, you can't just recreate something that's 2,000 years old and, you know, it's just, it doesn't work that way. Having said that, yes, biochar, um, you know, the way things work in soil is not just chemical or just physical or just biological. Everything has to work together. And, and one of the ways we know that biochar helps improve yields is by uh, providing conditions that favor beneficial microbes. Still not, we still don't really have a good idea how to recreate the terra preta kind of soils, whether we want the higher temperatures, lower temperatures, mm -hmm. some kind of combination. Yeah. We're still trying to work all, all that out. by the avian aquamizer our poop free chicken water visit us on the web at www.avianaquamizer.com